The deadly Henderson dog on dog attack over the weekend, making some pet owners question the safety of their own animals. So the mauling happened in a backyard after the neighbor's dog escaped through the fence and then attacked a Belgian Malinois. As Kristen Drummond reports, part of the investigation now falls under the vicious animals code. Henderson police say dogs accused of attacking another dog are impounded on a case by case basis, depending on many factors. <laughs> Animal control impounded the female American bulldog seen in this disturbing video mauling a Belgian shepherd. But before deeming a dog vicious, Henderson police need to investigate. I'm hoping that they will look at everything and judge it and be non biased. Mary Carly spoke with me on Monday. She wants justice for her dog, Nikolai, who was put down following his injuries. He was a big. Sweetheart. Henderson Municipal Code says declaring a dog vicious can happen if it causes the death of a domesticated animal. The owner can go through an appeal process, but a vicious dog is held at the shelter until a resolution in the case. Any issues with the dog prior to this? Just the dogs barking back and forth along the fence like nor normal dogs do. <laughs> A dog trainer advises neighbors to try and socialize their dogs. Let the dogs get to know each other. To avoid any potential issues. Maybe go for a walk. That way it's not such a novelty of the backyard. They never really get to see each other. It's always the talking, bantering, back and forth barking. We can reduce barking that way. And possibly a similar scenario if a dog escapes. Kristen Drummond, 8 News Now.